Michael Kay here on the Rich Eisen Show. Let's hit Le'Veon Bell. You mentioned how Odell's the most uh, talented giant since Lawrence Taylor. You could say this is the most talented jet, certainly at the position since Curtis Martin. Um, and what he's been able to do, now the Jets have him uh, to help balance out Sam Darnold, new coach. Uh, Crowder is not a slouch either. Uh, pick up the slot receiver. And C.J. Mosley, they really paid him to put him right in the middle of their defense. Uh, do you think the Jets have put together a team that can threaten the New England Patriots in the AFC East, Michael Kay? A lot of it depends Obviously, if Darnold takes the next step, the second-year step that a lot of those quarterbacks take, um, I would have liked if, if Barr didn't change his mind, giving them somebody to get to the quarterback. But now with the moves that they made, and I like the moves they've made a lot, they can use that number three pick to get an edge rusher and in the draft. And they're so good, Michael. I saw them at the combine myself. I mean, it was one eye-popper after another at the combine at that pass rush position they're they're deep and certainly if murray goes first overall um they 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 can have their pick not named bosa essentially i think i i agree i mean they're they're in a good situation i think they've gotten better uh i think they're obviously they're better than the dolphins who look like they're breaking it down uh they're better than the bills i i, I don't think that they've caught up to the patriots but um i think they've taken great steps they really have i think they've spent their money wisely Aggressively, they didn't get any. The, the, I think the best bargain they got, Rich, was Le'Veon Bell, who I think overrated his value in the market. And now you really have to wonder about the wisdom of him sitting out last year. And That's fourteen million dollars he'll never get back, and he's essentially taking the same contract with the Jets that that, that the Steelers offered. So I, I don't understand it, and uh, we'll see if, if it works out for him. I wonder if he's regretting what he did, but. He gets to play in New York City where he certainly could sell his brand, and he's a great player, and he's going to play with a, a potentially outstanding quarterback. So everything the Jets have done so far, other than lose out on Barr, who went, I guess went back on his word, I think they've done a, a great job. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.